Oh man. Thunder and lightning going crazy here at the house. My dog is scared. Come here, doggy. We have, uh, I'm just doing a little test tonight. I was going to just show everyone how to attach a Unicorn iMini to GS Pro. And then I'm going to review the video, make sure everything looks good, uh, and go from there. But let's start with, you got to turn the iMini on first. Unlike a Garmin, it sits uh, to the side of where you hit, whereas a Garmin uh, sits behind you. After you do that, you need to have the Unicord Launcher software. And if we refresh, it should start to see it. There we go. Nope, still not found. Refresh. There it goes. So it found it, and then you have this third party connector. You uh, hit start, and then you can launch GS Pro. You can actually set this. Here's the launcher. You can set this to launch GS Pro for you, which is what I did. Uh, and so you get the GS Pro launch window. I accidentally pushed it. And you push play. And then the launcher window. We can bring that up again. There we go. It's going to check uh, this API here. Bring that over, and it is now connected. Um, you can still do advanced, and then you can do a club view. This just shows you the little camera view of the club hitting, and then you can still do this view as well. So a lot uh, to look at data-wise if that's what you want to do. And everything connects pretty easily. There's like no settings. Um, everything comes up, everything looks good, it all works. Uh, the little camera is fun to like keep on the other screen and look at your contacts, and then it just sits in the background and connects everything. So, we're gonna play a little GS Pro, um, and then we're probably gonna do a live stream for real tomorrow if this comes out looking good. So, 